with them opening up the force on the line, uh, it definitely gave me an opportunity to come in to expand my knowledge and uh, skills to help better myself and also help provide, like I said, for my family. So it's, it's been a very, very good experience. The first week I was here, it was like I had known these people for years. They were friendly, how can I help you? If you have any questions, let me know. I'm one of those type of people that likes to always be hands-on and doing stuff. And I know with the four-cylinder line, I'm going to get that. The open arms that they offered with us as we walked in was wonderful. The teaching and everything that they give us, the classes, and you know, it was just a big family-oriented organization. <laughs> You pretty much see positive attitudes, employees who look forward to coming to work and doing their job, which kind of motivates me to um, want to come to work and also expand my knowledge and do my job much better. I have that personality. Uh, so it helps being here where a lot of the people around me are positive too. You walk by somebody and they're uplifted. And like, man, that thing's going good today. We got, we accomplished this today. And you know, you feed off one and the other one feeds off you. And then everybody's bumped up. It's just the atmosphere that's here. It's a, a family atmosphere. It was just a great opportunity for me to go and help the community uh, that Toyota's letting me go help. I got actually got stopped at a restaurant when we were out in Hansville, and uh, they asked why we were there, and I said, oh, we're volunteering. You know, Toyota's paying us to come out here and help y'all, and the guy was so appreciative. I've never done that before. I've never had a company volunteer time like Toyota has. I was proud to wear my Toyota t-shirt saying that I volunteered. You know, you go into work, you're excited. I said, you, you're not dreading it. I said, you're excited about going. And i like, why? I said, the opportunities that they offer you. I want to progress in the company. Group leader spot comes open, you know, that'd be something I'd be interested in. They're always motivating you, always pushing you to go further, to see the limits that you can actually go above and beyond. You know, I want to move up the ladder. I don't look at staying just a team member because Toyota's offered so much that you can go in to be besides just a team member. And now, you know, I want to take advantage of that. I want to do some things that are challenging to me. So hopefully a couple years down the line, I can maybe see myself beyond team member, maybe TL, which is team leader, or group leader maybe one day. Who knows, maybe upstairs. I truly can see myself going up to the next level. Like I say, it could be management, it could be HR, maybe the president one day. Jim Bolte retires in a couple more years, probably. I'll probably move into his spot, president of the plant, something like that. But other than that, nothing really, just move straight into that president spot. Well, my wife has a Toyota, so when I bought that car, I knew the quality that went into that car and how long that car is going to last. We had bought a Toyota before I got hired on, and now that I'm here, he's wanting a Toyota Tundra, so. <laughs> We're making history in this community. Alabama is gonna be the first state to have all three engines built under one facility. We're making history in Alabama. It's all about being a team here. We all have to work together to get it done. We work together to get it done, and it can be done. As far as I know, that's making a lot of history in Alabama. <laughs> Probably here in North America, period. We might be making history in the world. 
and it's awesome to be a part of the history, to be a part of Toyota. It's just a really good company to work for. One, two, three, yos!